We are like looked at as like role models, so we try to set a very high standard for the younger girls when it's their turn to be able to be a captain or a leader for the team. On the field, I'm, I would say I'm a pretty loud communicator, so I'm not afraid to like tell people like where to go and what to do in like a nice way. I was very excited because I've been with this program for four years and I've been on varsity since I was a freshman. So I've always looked up to my captains. I think it's a huge honor. I mean, I've been in the soccer program since seventh grade and uh, seeing all the captains previously, it's like a big deal to be a captain in this program. It's pretty fun having the girls look up to us. They were named captains due to the players' votes and the coaches' votes. Um, they're four of our five seniors this year. The girls really look up to them and they're very inclusive. We're actually doing better than we have in the past years. We're three, one, and one right now. We've just been clicking as a team. Like we had a team sleepover for initiation night and we all just kind of are able to communicate on the field really well. I think we're like a really high energy group. We all have like a lot of fun together. I guess our bond is a lot better this year. We've all kind of grown up together and I think it's finally we're all clicking together as a high school team. This is our first year just being a Spring Lake Park team. We um, are no longer co opted with St. Anthony this year. Um, so the girls have really come together as a family. We're already beating our record from last year. Me and all the other captains have been playing together since we were really little kids. So. I'd say we're all really close with each other. They've been my good friends forever, so it's pretty fun to experience this with them. They're all really awesome people, a great group of girls. And there's some girls on the team that haven't been playing like as long as others, so then we try to like sprinkle our ideas and um, skills onto them. This year we set out five values for the team to follow every practice and every game. Work hard, have fun, be positive, enjoy the season, and be committed. Mindy's really awesome because She's really like relatable and like she makes practice a lot of fun. Well, Mindy. She makes things fun because she knows that you have to work hard, but she puts the hard work into fun activities. So basically you don't know you're working hard, but you really are. We play blindfolded dodgeball just to work on our communication throughout the field. It's really nice just to be able to bond with her like that. She's really fun. She always knows how to like talk to us. Like she knows if something's wrong. Like she really knows like you want a personal level, not just like as a soccer player. I look for people who are leaders on the field and off the field, and players that are just willing to give 110% every single day. Um, like I said earlier, that we're really a family, um, and having that feeling come from the girls as well as the coaching staff is really important. Um, building relationships with them and just making sure that they know that we're here for them to improve and we're here for them to uh, work together and, and reach their goals for the year. Go Panthers! <laughs>